Hi guys, I don't know if you've ever heard of augmented reality before or you've even ever used it. Personally, I've heard of it before, but I didn't know it was available for so many different devices. You can actually use it for the iPhone, and today I'm going to show you three different cool augmented reality apps that you can get for iOS. First of all, I want to show you this app called McLaren P1. This is going to be kind of hard to show you on my phone, but I'm going to do the best I can. So, you have augmented reality. You have a piece of paper here. This is a car, as you can see. You put it on the table. You can open this app, and basically this is going to open your camera app. I'm going to say getting started. And so this is my camera right here. You can see everything in here. But once you point it down at this piece of paper, it's going to walk onto this car. And it's going to use this piece of paper to create this virtual car on your screen. I think this is really cool, personally. And the paper actually interacts with this virtual car. So if I take the paper and if I move it, the car moves also, as you can see here. This is a really cool app and works really smooth. Also, if I zoom in closer to this car, you're actually going to see it gets closer to the car. And you can actually get a really close detailed look at it. This is really cool. In addition, this app also shows the aerodynamics of the car and you can toggle these and it. you can even see exactly how these work. Even if you're not really into cars, this is a really cool app just to show how exactly augmented reality works. I can even take this piece of paper, I can lift it up. As you can see, this is, this is the paper. Really cool. I can move it around, whatever. The second app I want to show you is called AR Defender. I'm going to open this up and it works the same way. You basically you have a piece of paper here, put it on the table or the floor, or whatever. Open up the app here as soon as it loads. Okay, again, I'm going to lock onto this and it's going to create a little tower here. This is actually a game you can interact with. After I push go, I'm going to be attacked by these little things, these little bombs, and basically your objective is to defend the tower. It's unlocked there. And basically you can move this turret around your tower and use it to attack these little bomb guys. I mean, the game is pretty simple, but it's kind of cool how it works. Again, you have this little piece of paper right here. You can pick it up and it's actually, you can see it kind of glitches there, but I can re- my thumb got in the way there, but I can rewalk onto it there. And basically, the game moves with the paper. It's really cool. And again, if I zoom in closer, the tower gets bigger. You can see I can get a more detailed view here. It's a really cool app as well that uses augmented reality. Really cool. Third app I want to show you this is a pretty simple app. It's called AR Basketball. As you can expect, basically, you play basketball. This one's not as smooth. As you can see, it's kind of jittery a little bit. But it is kind of a pretty cool concept. Basically, you have this basketball hoop, and you know you obviously shoot the balls into it. Um, again, pretty simple idea. I'm sure they'll update it in the future to make it run a little smoother. It doesn't run bad, but compared to these other apps that are really good and smooth, you can kind of see the difference. So the cool thing about all these apps and the way augmented reality works is I got the first app I show you, the McLaren. This is a piece of paper I use, and this is the other piece of paper I use. So as you can see, this piece of paper is bigger than the other piece. This is just a shrunken down version. So if I open this up, I'm going to open up this app again. And I zoom in on this, you're going to get a car that's probably about half the size of the table. However, if I pull this out, put in this smaller piece of paper, it actually the piece of the size of the paper actually determines how big the car is. So you can see I used a smaller piece of paper. So the car is about uh, the size, I don't know, probably about a little bigger than a Hot Wheel. 
it's cool because it works the same way. Basically, you know, you can change your aerodynamics and everything. Everything works good. It's just, since it's a smaller piece of paper, you get a smaller car. I found that the bigger piece of paper actually works better because it has more detail, so it can lock onto it easier. But again, this app is really cool. You get a really detailed car, and you can move it around, zoom in. Oops. You can zoom in. Really awesome app, and I'm going to be looking for some more augmented reality apps in the future. But here's a little look at them. You can kind of see what they are and what they do. I want to do more videos like this in the future, focusing on some pretty cool apps rather than just reviews and stuff like that. Hope you guys like this video, and I'll see you in the next one.